what you're seeing here is the Rift Warren Stellan outfit coming out tonight in the item shop, January 18th. Epic Games, a big thank you for the early access. Let's see what the set includes. So the outfit from head to toe, incredible detail. Um, I know you're curious already about how it's gonna be aiming down sights with the shoulder armor. But let me show you here, and to my surprise, it's really not that bad. It really isn't. I'll take off the mask as well here. Even with the mask off, still looks fine. I like it with the mask on personally, but I have no issues here. I thought the armor might have gotten in the way, but it's not bad at all. Not only is aiming down sights pretty good, but it does have unique footsteps, and this is what it sounds like on different surfaces. So not only are the footsteps super delicate sounding, but it also like sounds like bones rattling as well. The back bling is called Warden Star, and here's some combos with that. It is a very stingy gold, but it looks great on Midas Rex here. That looks amazing. Aura with the third style, even though no gold on this particular style, I think the theme is really fun. You can see here, that with this gold, it's not really there. It's not as orange as what we're used to seeing here. I think Joni the Red looks amazing with her alternate style. Also, with the original style, if I can change it here, that looks really damn good. It's a fun theme as well. I'd say it's pretty fun. Left Thorn, the gold is off, but the theme is 10 out of 10. With the spikes on the shield and the spikes on the shoulder, can't go wrong. Moro, I never use it. I sometimes forget it exists, but it looks pretty damn clean on both outfits here, male and female. So maybe try that one out because this skin does not get a lot of love. And it's definitely forgotten for sure. And then obviously this is what it came with. The harvesting tool is the Warden's Oath. And this is what it looks like and sounds like with the impact. The impact has a lot of different colors in it. Pay attention to that. And it looks really good in game as well. Equip on equip. It sounds like a sword, but I mean, that's what it is. Blurred out version. Impact, hello. That looks really good. Weak spots as well here. Yeah, the impact is a nice, vibrant combination of different colors there. That's a nice impact. Honestly, I was expecting like a default, but damn. And can I point it out here? Of course not. Thanks, Fortnite. Thank you. Lastly, the weapon wrap here, Rift Warden's Raiment. Um, not reactive, not animated, but this is what it looks like on the Asturias style and machine learning sets. I think it looks pretty damn good, honestly. I don't really have any complaints there. Usually I'm not a big fan of how it looks on a larger scale, but I gotta give it to them. This looks great on this set. And now on the show your style of cosmetics, honestly, still not bad. But I think because of the design and textures, it looked really good with how the machine learning set split it up on the outfit alone. This doesn't look bad, but I gotta give it to the machine learning set here. It looks way better on that, in my opinion, obviously. And lastly, we have the loading screen, which looks amazing. What I will say here about the outfit is the detail that is focused on with the bones and the arms and hands like morphing into the armor, I think is a really great idea. And like you saw there, aiming down sides is not terrible. It's not bad at all. The glider is going to be a little dark here, the Blade Raven. But I think the theme is still really fun here because we do have the accents of red on the outfit. So I think it's fine there. Um, I don't have a lot of complaints here. I mean, I love the footsteps. I love the vibe, but I still would choose the tier 100 that we have in the battle pass over this, but this is the helmet on as well. We also took off the back bling here, but you can see the hair physics as well. Probably a little more prominent than when the back bling was on. I wasn't really paying attention to it, but you can see the detail underneath the hair there. It'd be like the backside of your rib cage. It looks really good. I'm just not, I think maybe because it feels so skinny is why I'm slightly turned off from it, but it looks great. And from everyone on Twitter, this is a male outfit. Not that it matters what gender it is, but it is a male outfit. I just think the shoes might be a little dainty <laughs> for me personally, but overall a pretty creative skin. Um, I think it was done very well. Like I said, this is a very stingy gold. So go easy on me here. Corrupted long legs. The Katana alternate style, I'd say it's pretty damn close, not bad. 
hollow bones incredible theme with the outfit being made out of bone armor and yeah it's a little dark but i can get around that for sure pack bone it's a little weird but i like the bone theme for sure once again and then this is what it came with um pretty tough for combos if you wanted to have a fun theme it is very tough for combos in my opinion overall the skin was executed very well i just don't know if it's necessarily my cup of tea regardless coming out tonight january 18th epic games thank you again support required piz zero and we see you nerds on the live stream see ya